guys, PJ, so whatever time here. Um, today, I am going to uh, read a book today. It's I Survived the Joplin Tornado 2011. And as you can see, you can see a monster tornado chasing after that boy. So, let's get started. I Survived the Joplin Tornado 2011. Chapter 1. Sunday, May 22nd, 2011, at 5.42 p.m., Joplin, Missouri. A monster EF-5 tornado was destroying the city of Joplin, Missouri. And 11-year-old Dexter, James, was in its killer grip. The tornado had snuck up onto the city, hiding behind a wall of storm clouds. Few knew it was coming, and nobody imagined that within minutes it would kill 158 people and destroy much of the city. It and the hours before Joplin had hummed with happy life, cheers of cheers of rose up from little league fields, gardens bloomed with roses. And wild strawberries churches echoed with prayers and hums. It was a typical Sunday afternoon until the day turned dark and wind began to howl. And the sky exploded like a bomb. The tornado was up to three quarters of a mile wide with winds that topped 200 miles per hour. It swept away houses and blasted the wreckage of thousands of feet into the sky. It tore apart schools and sent shores crashing down onto people inside. Cars flew through the air. Trucks turned into missiles. Century-old trees were ripped from the ground, the tornado sirens wailed. People rushed to their basements and huddled in the bathtub as their houses collapsed on top of them. Parents gripped their children as the cruel winds tried to there tear them away. In minutes, entire neighborhoods lay in ruins. Dex was in an SUV when the tornado hit, and now he was trapped. The ferocious winds roared and sent the tree limbs and rocks smashing against the SUV. Then smash! A window shattered. The tornado's fury blast, fury blast into the F SUV. Dex was attacked by swirling glass. The pain was like being stung by thousands of scorpions over and over again. And then the wind grabbed hold of Dex. It wrapped him around like an invisible tentacles, pulling him towards the open window. Dex had always wanted to see a tornado for real. And now here it was, the evil swirling darkness. Dex be being sucked into the tornado and he knew there was no way to escape. Okay, that was chapter one. I'm going to read chapter two later. Thank you.